Why? Hello and welcome everybody. So today I wanted to go ahead and update you guys with that build idea or the league idea I was talking about for the uh, Road to Legacy. We have actually went ahead and went through with it and it's been interesting. I haven't really gotten to do anything yet. So basically uh, all I really did is I started off with the jug. So as you can see here, if I open up a random map, pop this open here, you can see that stashes cannot be used. So we have no stash tabs. Um, or no stash in general at the moment we have a global 912 taken over and at the moment I believe there are about 70 people there are currently 70 people more people want to join so I make crowdfund for some extra I didn't play too much yesterday I played for like six hours or so mainly mainly just having fun so we are right over here at level 58 went to bed and some guy is zooming over here we got a level 87 so we're gonna have to go catch up to them but yeah so so far everything is pretty much as exactly as I expected I have this whole right block of my inventory right now for crafting currency. Uh, at, on the left here, I have like dupe currency, so like my extra wisdoms, which realistically don't need to be there. Uh, and these are pretty much essences that I'm just using literally on the fly to get any equipment possible to progress. Uh, I know a lot of people are going to ask why I'm playing Jug and not Inquisitor anymore. Jug just feels better when you have no currency. Inquisitor feels really good when you have like Shaper, Life Kingdom Block, or Aegis Melding. None of those I have right now, so right now I just want to play Jug. It's just easier to get into. Um, so I have a pretty lucky weapon. <laughs> I know it looks shit, but it's actually pretty good. Uh, 30 Ellie base, 20 fire multi, and then I just crafted fire damage. Standard 4 link helmet right now for my uh, burn damage, Ellie focus, righteous fire, ink AoE. Um, currently running with uh, controlled destruction, combustion, fire trap, life tap. Not the best links, but it's what we have. Got my hex touch, flammability, frost blink setup. Uh, in our boots, we've got an efficacy being leveled with, what is this? I can't even see because of my microphone. Life tap, summon stone golem, leap slam. Basically just a scuffed shield charge setup because I don't have shield charge yet. Vitality, molten shell, arrogance, and then malevolence, determined purity. And uh, the jug runs the exact same auras as the inquisitor in the early. You've got like purity of elements, malevolence, determined. And then later I drop uh, purity for tempest shield, skitterbot, but that's like far later. So it doesn't really matter right now. Which means I do have to get a source of shock immunity, uh, but we'll worry about that later. Yeah, so that's pretty much about it. Just to show you guys how this league works. You literally have no stash. It does not exist. This is where my stash would normally be. Uh, you have a high locker, Lily, a crafting bench, a horticulture. Um, then you have bestiary. And so currently I have trade on, so people are allowed to trade. I personally will be doing limited trading as, you know, I want most of my progression to just be suffering for some unknown reason uh but i turned on trade because there's a lot of like newer people who wanted to kind of just like play and have fun and trade uniques and stuff like that and i mean it's not a competitive league it's just for fun right um so that's pretty much how that's gonna work but yeah so far people are pretty happy and i really want to see how this changes in maps because doing the campaign with no inventory is pretty i don't know it's just very bland but i think in mapping is when you really get to I don't know, mapping is when you get your upgrades, it's when you have more inventory management, it's when you're going to struggle, so mapping is where I'm honestly really, really excited for. Anyway, that's pretty much about it, so I'm going to catch you guys all later. Thanks for watching, everybody. If you guys are curious why I have no webcam on, it's because I'm currently drying my hair. So, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys on the live stream. If, uh, you know, if people want to crowdfund more, I can drop a direct link down below. But otherwise, if I drop a link down below, there's going to be like a wait list of like 200 people. So for now, we're just keeping it like this. So anyway, catch you guys all later. Remember, if you enjoy the video, please feel free to like, share and subscribe. And uh, don't forget, you can catch me streaming live every day, but Mondays at twitch.tv slash box. See you guys all tomorrow.